this was absolutely my parents. When I get the school bus to go to school, they're like, oh, you're so lucky. Back in the day when we went to school, did any of your parents do this to you? I'm so glad. I'm not the only one. But there has been an epidemic of under-management from leaders. There's been an epidemic of under-management from parents. And so it's not just under-management, it's over-management at the same time. And so those four things have come together in a very, very unique way to create Gen Z in the way that Gen Z have been created. Does that make sense to you? They have wired them. And so what I, what I want to show you is this. There's an analogy, and I'm going to use it a lot today, so catch this analogy. It's not a complicated one. Everybody who's millennial and older, you are blue, and in this instance, you're blue paint. All the blue painters, show me your hands again, millennial and older. Okay, thank you, thank you, thank you. You're all blue paint, okay? This perfect storm that I've just explained to you, that is yellow paint. Those four things I just explained to you. Now you pour those things onto the world, and slowly but surely, the world starts to turn green. Does that make sense? So I want you to know, everybody that's blue, you will be turning green. In fact, I'm going to show you one or two ways you are already green. So the world of tomorrow is green, and once you're green, you can't go back to blue. You know that, right? 